What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. This is gonna be part four. Uh, basically, we got, uh, I changed the tires on it um, because the other ones were bald, trashed, cars all over the place. I just took it around the block now. It's like 50% better, it still needs an alignment, but I'm pretty sure we can crack off one decent log. Uh, that way we can send it to Doc Wu and then we'll take the car over to the alignment shop and get it lined up. So I'll walk you guys through the process of how I do it. Uh, make sure traction is off. This is an all-wheel drive car, so I'm not too worried about. Uh, right now it's a little bit wet out. It should still grip. We're only on waist gate. It's not like we're at 30 pounds of boost or anything like that. Um, so basically, you just want to connect your JB4. You got the app pulled up here. connected and then I'll go to my logs I'll delete any previous logs that I have I'll start fresh um, and then these are the monitors that I have set up so I got boost trans temperature AFRs I have my low pressure pump and my uh, rail pressure right there so we'll do a third gear log and uh, we'll do from like 3k to 6k we'll send that over pretty good no timing corrections or anything we're at 16 pounds of boost targeting 17 so we're not too far off 73 psi was our low pressure 1100 was our high pressure which is pretty good trims are at 31 so we might need a little bit more fueling there it's not crazy and yeah overall seems pretty good i'll go ahead and uh Email this over. And I'll let Doc Blue do his magic. That's it, pretty much uh, all we gotta do. Now we'll uh, go ahead and take this over to the alignment shop. boys so we just got the car back from the alignment shop um we're ready to do some logging now um doc Wu sent me some changes to do on the jb4 which we've done we're now in map four which i believe is 22 psi if i'm not mistaken so 22 or 23 something like that uh so we're gonna do a log from 3k to 6k again and uh see what it looks like So we did our um, we did our log in map four, which was 23 psi. Um, everything looked good. Uh, we got the okay. 
um, to go to map six and we're gonna set some custom values actually I'll put uh, right here a little clip of um, the email that we got from Doc Vu uh, with the changes that we're gonna be doing and the setup on map six so we're gonna uh, go into our JB4 set it up like he wants us to and then we'll do a log on map six which I think he's gonna have us at 24 25 pounds um, so we'll do that now we'll grab a log send it out and wait for um, a revision or if he says it's it's good there then it's good there I mean we're on revision not even revision because we're still on his base map we're just doing changes on JB4 um, and we done maybe like three four changes and the car is pretty much done right now uh, we're just gonna dial in the final map map six and we're good to go so I'll leave it at that I'm gonna probably run to the gas station we're at about a quarter tank fuel so I'll throw some more heat in it uh, and that's it and she's good to go and I believe the owner is coming by tonight to pick it up so maybe we'll take a ride with him and get his reaction see what he thinks about it and go from there Alright, we're going to try and grab a quick little log on this road here, third gear, 3000 RPM, we'll give her the beans. Beautiful. This thing is an absolute ripper. We're on what? 24 pounds? Yeah, and she's just a beast. Alright. We'll send this log over to Doc and see what he says. Oh my god. Wild, right? That's crazy. Yeah. I mean, you you barely got into it, bro. Wait till you do a full pull. That is crazy. Yeah, I was only like 4,000. Yeah. Jesus. Oh my God. Yeah. That is crazy. That's, uh, that's 25 pounds. So that's basically like your race map. Yeah. And then you have map 4 and map 3 as like a regular everyday driving map. Well, that's going to be a wrap for part 4 of this uh, 335 XI single turbo install. Hope you guys enjoyed this small little series. Um, customer is excited about his uh, new build. Um, car came out great. No issues at all with the install. Uh, tuning was a breeze. We got tuning done basically in a day uh, with Doc Vu, as you guys can see. It's, it's pretty simple. Um, just just follow the steps of whatever your tuner tells you to do. Um, and yeah, I mean, that car is dialed in. Uh, very reliable, you know, 25 pounds of boost on a kill map. Um, the thing makes great power. Obviously, we didn't get it on a dyno. But on a 67 mil with 25 pounds, he's he's probably making some decent power. Um, and yeah, I mean, it'll be reliable at that boost level. He, he has the option to turn it down if he needs to, or if he wants to go up to like 26 or 27, we have that option too. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed. We'll leave it, we'll leave it at this. Uh, so, this next video, uh, we have a little surprise. Uh, hopping on a plane tomorrow going to Boston and uh, we're going to be potentially looking at another vehicle to bring here to the shop or to Chicago so um, I won't spill the beans on that yet that will be on the next video so you guys will have a chance to see um, but I'm pretty excited it's a really really nice car um, at least from the pictures that I've seen and I've been talking to this guy for a few days now seems like a good guy is taken care of so um yeah the next video you guys will see i'll be in boston and uh we'll be doing a little vlog style for that trip to uh to boston and we'll be checking out the car and seeing if uh if it's worth it or not but i think uh 
I think it will be from what I've seen in the pictures and talking to the guys. So, all right, uh, we'll leave it at that. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys on the next video.